With this deal finally in place, how will you be impacted? Fox 11's Beth Jones takes a closer look. The fiscal cliff deal uh, adds some complexity to the uh, tax code. CPA Robert Mathers says the majority of Americans won't see an increase in federal income taxes. However, because the payroll tax cut expired Monday, most of you will end up with less in your paycheck. This means households making between forty and fifty thousand dollars a year will see their taxes increase about five hundred and eighty dollars. Households making between fifty and seventy five thousand dollars a year will face an average increase of about eight hundred and twenty dollars. But those higher on the pay scale will see an increase in their federal income taxes. Above four hundred and fifty thousand uh, dollars there's a higher tax rate. It's the highest tax rate we've seen in over a decade. The rate is 39.6 percent, up from the current 35 percent. Experts predicted the cliff could have triggered another recession. However, Mathers feels the deal will bode well for the economy, especially with certain tax credits. The uh, American Opportunities Credit and the Child Tax Credit have been extended for five years. Those are, are big benefits to the uh, average American. Um, in addition, the President's bill uh, extends the research and experimentation credit. And so clients like mine that are big with innovation uh, will benefit from that and that will spur additional spending. The deal is also good news for two million jobless Americans who will still receive extended federal unemployment benefits. That includes 40,000 Wisconsin residents. While the deal has provided some relief, most know there's still a lot of work to be done in Washington. That includes tackling the debt ceiling. Beth Jones, Fox 11 News.